Hi guys. Um, I am just hopping on really, really quick because everyone keeps asking me um, to do a video about Delta seasonal. It's called Delta seasonal jobs. And um, I did some research. I'm doing some research and kind of learning about it day by day. And um, so this is what I know. Um, every station might be different. Every um, airport may be different. So just kind of take what I say um, with a grain of salt. Um, most of it is accurate. Some of it is just what I've heard and what I'm learning about. Okay. So um, Delta has this um, program called um, Seasonal. And what I know of, you have to work between 150 and 800 hours a year. I did some um, calculations. And so 800 hours a year, I'm just going to let you know what that is. That's only 15 hours a week. Okay. If you did 52, day, 52 weeks out of the year, I've spoken to some people that have done it in bigger stations like LA, Denver, different places like that. And, um, they told me that they do, they do it during the high season. So they, they'd only worked maybe June, June through the end of August. Um, and, um, some people, um, work, um, the high season. So maybe June, um, the summer, maybe spring break, maybe Christmas, different places like that. They're also, um, it is a new program, um, because it used to be called um, Seasonal Ready Reserve. They used to have a Ready Reserve program that's not seasonal with Delta. And um, I think it was, you could work 150 to like maybe 1,500 or 1,600 hours a, a year. Um, they got rid of that and they um, allowed the agents that were ready, ready Reserve, and this program is old, probably 15, 20 years old. Um, they allowed them to become normal agents and then they started the new seasonal program. So they don't have ready reserve anymore. It's called seasonal. Um, other stations I'm hearing, they can use you throughout the year, but just remember there's a 15 hour a week max. So if they use you a lot in the summer for 30 or 40 hours a week, they're going to have to give you some time off, like months off or something like that. The fight benefits are the same. So you get to fly for free. Um, after one year, you do get to do your ID 90s and, and um, fly with other airlines, maybe 90, 95% off. Um, there is no health insurance. Um, what else? Um, they say it's really good for people that are teachers and people that are retired. So you're not really depending on that income because after August or maybe after the beginning of September, a lot of times you're not working um, for months and months at a time. As long as you fulfill your requirements of 150 hours within that year or whatever, they say that you still have flight benefits for the other two years until you reset it. Um, but as long as you have your, you know, do your 150 hours a year, um, you're still employed. Um, they said that you're still employed. You're still a full-fledged Delta employee employee. Um, but you're just limited to the hours. A lot of people do start off in that position and then they try to convert to regular full-time, or they don't really call it full-time agents, but a regular agent that has all the other type of benefits like health insurance and more hours and all of that stuff. You are able to trade. Um, and, um, and after two months, it's I think it's 60 days. So you can stack your shifts and different things. But Delta in our, in my state of California, it's a little bit harder to stack shifts unless you're working at least 40 and a half hours a week. Then they let you um, work two shifts in a row. You can, um, but you can also always do trades after 60 days. Um, what else did I learn about it? Um, you wear the same uniforms. You, you're the, the same. Um, you're the same as an agent. But the thing is, you do um, bid differently. You don't bid with the normal um, agents. And this is all, this is for, um, ramp. I'm talking about ramp and I'm talking about customer service. Um, you, so you bid, just say like for the seasonals, just say if there's 10 seasonals, I'm just going to do this random. So you bid with the seasonals. You don't bid with the regular agents. So that is the difference with that, um, I think it's a great program. I think it's good for people that have other jobs. Um, I think it's good for people that just are using it for the flight benefits and um delta is a great company and um that's all i have to say i hope you guys are doing awesome amazing and
and um, hopefully this answers some questions and I will talk to you guys later. Bye.